God. Can you just take away my free will? Excuse me, do you, do you, are you saying you don't want the greatest gift that I have given you? God? Yes. God? Yes. Yes, come on, speak up. Well, how can you call free will a gift? I don't have a receipt, I, I can't return it. Why would you want to return it in the first place? I'll tell you why right now. One word. Moral responsibility. <laughs> right, and what's wrong with moral responsibility? Let me tell you what's wrong with moral responsibility. It, Well, right now, I, I don't know what's wrong with it right now, but the, there's something wrong with it. There is something wrong with it. Well, how about I take away moral responsibility and just leave you with the free will? How does, how does that sound to you? Uh... No. Uh-huh. So it's not just moral responsibility now, huh? Come on, what else is bothering you? Excuse me? Excuse me, I asked you a question. Fine, you know what's bothering me? Sinning, that's, that's what it is. I don't like sinning either. Well, tell me this then. Why do you sin in the first place? I don't know why I sin, I just do. I, I can't control it, it just sneaks up on me like, like a shadow in the dark. Well, if that's true, and it's not really your fault, then you're not sinning of your own free will. And, at least according to me, not sinning at all. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I know that I'm sinning. It's just that I don't want to sin. If, I mean, if I, if, I could, if I could try harder, then I wouldn't sin, you know what I mean? Well, now, listen. Do or don't you try as hard as you can to avoid sinning? <sighs> it's a toughie. Well, at the time, I feel that I'm trying as hard as I can, but, you know... Afterwards, it's like, God, what the hell happened, you know? Okay, it sounds to me like you have no idea what's going on, all right? You, you don't know whether you're sinning or you're not, so... It could be possible that you haven't been sinning at all. Well, yeah, of course that's possible, but, you know, maybe I have been sinning. And that, that's what really freaks me out. Mm-hmm. And why does that freak you out? Are you serious? What about that little getaway place you have called Hell? Did you forget about that? My grandmother's like a spokesman for that place. Alright, alright. I saw that one coming. So that's what's really bothering you now, huh? Well, what was all that talk about moral responsibility and whatnot? Don't, don't order turkey when you want ham, my friend. Why didn't you just say that you didn't want me to punish you for your sins? What, are you serious? I know you're not gonna do that. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you knew everything I was going to do. Every day, every hour, every minute. Why don't, why aren't I asking you all the questions about this stuff, huh? How about we switch it around here? What was that all about? Okay, listen. How about I do this? How about I do this special edition, kind of grant you a little thing I like to call. You can do whatever you want, sin as much as you like, and I won't send you to hell. Or strike you. Lightning. 
How does that sound? No, don't do that. What? What's wrong? You don't trust me? Of course I trust you. I, I don't want to sin, though. That's the big thing here. I don't want to sin. And I don't want to go to hell, either. <sighs> All right. How about this? How about... Yeah, how about I give you this pill? Magic pill. God's pill. You just swallow it and all your cares go right out the window. You can sin as much as you like and you have no regrets. Isn't that like alcohol? All right, smart guy. How about letting me finish what I was gonna say? I was gonna say that you wouldn't be punished by myself or you or anything else. So I'm gonna go ahead and send that pill down. What? No! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm even taking away your abhorrence of sinning. I don't even think you know what that word means, but what else is bothering you? Come on, what is it? I'm not gonna take your pill. I don't even take Tylenol. Well, why not? Because it does nothing for my headaches. No! Why won't you take my pill? God's pill. Because that pill may take away my future abhorrence of sinning, but my present abhorrence of sinning is enough for me not to be willing to take it. Okay, I command you to take it. No, I refuse. What? You refuse of your own free will? Yes. All right. So it seems your free will comes in pretty handy now, doesn't it? I don't understand. You're telling me. What was that? So are you glad that you have free will to say that you do not want the pill? God's pill? W what, would you have liked it if I forced you to take that pill, whether you wanted to or not? No, don't do that! I wasn't going to, come on, I was just making a point. Alright, look, how about I take away your free will and then you take the pill no matter what? Yeah, but once my free will's gone, how could I possibly choose to take that free, that, your pill? Whoa, 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 I wouldn't say that you would choose it. I said that you would take it. You know, as if it were two deterministic laws. As a matter of fact, you would just take it. Well, I still refuse to take it. So now you don't want me to take away your free will. Isn't this a little different from what we originally started off with? I see what you're doing here. Th this can't be right, though. We're gonna, have to, we're gonna have to go over this again. After you. Well, you said two things that don't even, don't even make sense to me. First you said that I can't sin unless I do so of my own free will. And then you said that you were going to give me a pill, God's pill, that would take away my free will. And then that I could sin as much as I liked. But if I didn't have free will, then how could I be sinning? Okay, I don't think you were listening at all. I didn't say that the pill, God's pill would deprive you of your free will. I said that it would only remove your abhorrence of sinning. I still don't understand what you're talking about. Listen, let me try to explain this to you as easily as possible to where I think you'd be able to understand. Let's say that I take away your free will, but you do understand that you will commit a ton of bad things. But once your free will is gone, it won't technically be sinning because you won't really know what you're doing. You'd be like a robot. And in the end, you won't even feel bad about anything because there will be no moral responsibility. And any abhorrence you have toward these acts will just disappear. Yeah, but me knowing now what I would do without free will is enough for me not to let you remove my free will. Hmm. So let me get this absolutely straight. You don't want me to remove your free will anymore. No, I guess not. 